Oh, I forgot to tell you, Happy Women's Day. Look at my fake smile. It's a very fake smile because there is no happy in Women's Day anymore. So I've been getting a lot of happy Women's Day messages since morning and I also was very happy that oh look I have so many friends that are wishing me but you know who all of them are Amazon, Ola, Uber, Flipkart even BSNL has started sending uh, Nari Shakti messages. What Nari Shakti? We've all been reduced to some Nari Pona Shakti. The happy in Women's Day is only for the corporates that have appropriated this particular day for themselves. I am being given special offers on everything. I get this eyebrow done. I get this eyebrow free. Justice for Aarti. Justice for uh, Hatras rape victim. Justice for Nirbhaya. Justice for Bilkis Bano. Justice for Ankita Bandari. Justice for... Just add any name there. You can even find my name. If you Google Vinodhani, you will get the name of an acid attack victim called Vinodhani. These hashtag justice for dash 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 these names change but the incidents remain the same rape murder sexual abuse sexual harassment acid attacks honor killings gender based violence in the last 10 years rape vulnerability of women in the country has increased to up to 44 percent a woman gets raped every 16 minutes do the math there are still villages in india where girl children are killed as soon as they are born three women are trafficked every day Every 84 minutes, a bride is murdered over dowry harassment and there are at least 12 acid attacks per month in this country. 3 out of every 10 married women have faced some form of domestic violence. You are saying not all men, but we are saying all men. Yes, all men. You have a problem with that. What will you do? You will abuse us using any one of the hundreds of slur words which are mostly women's private parts or anything that degrades a woman. What are we doing as a society dealing with all this? Is society challenging all the inherently held beliefs on masculinity? Have all workplaces installed posh committees? Are governments supporting the survivors? Are they increasing the number of hotlines and shelters that will help survivors of gender-based violence? Do women have safe spaces where their voices will be heard? Every woman in this country knows what it is to be stalked and groped and be a victim of online abuse. Governments may come and go. Families will disappear. New families will come in their place. But in every one of these setups, women will still be the lowest in the hierarchy. You want us to talk about the roses and the gifts that you give us on Women's Day? In this country, it does not matter what happens to a woman. It matters who the woman is, what her background is, what her privileges are or are not for her to be able to get justice or for her to at least reach a place where she can have access to somebody who can give her justice or somebody who knows somebody who knows somebody who knows somebody who can give her justice. But we women have to console ourselves that at least there is a common denominator in all this. That no matter what caste or class uh, we belong to or what political affiliations we have, what our background is, who we know, none of it matters that as a victim we are going to be shamed and blamed. Welcome to Happy Women's Day where justice will be served in What are you waiting for?